This is Rob. I know I'm just kind of showing you comp pictures of my OXO, my uh, Technovorm Mocha Master, and my Opix. Uh, and I'm not doing this for, for fun, but this is my coffee vault. Uh, it keeps your coffee fresh. Now, I just happen to like these products. I think they're pretty awesome, but I want to give you a quick update. Um, I get a lot of questions lately around how much coffee do I need to make a great cup of coffee? Well, I make on, with my Mocha Master here, 10 cups at a time, because that's just how I am. Um, I love this. It takes me somewhere around 55 to 60 grams of coffee to put into my filter, and, uh, and then I'm good to go. I use number four filters here um, you know, with this unit loaded up, and this thing is a magical piece of equipment, and it does amazing pots of coffee. Now, if you don't have something like this, maybe you're working with a mix of Mr. Coffee or a Breville or a what have you, um, just think, and it's really going to be for flavor of what you're trying to accomplish. Like, what do you like to drink? Typically, you want one to two heaping teaspoons of ground coffee per cup that you're making. Um, there's much more fine measurements. Again, having a nice little uh, scale to do what you need to do. But, you know, if you're, if you're looking for just trying to make a decent cup and you know you want a little darker, two tablespoons of coffee are the way to go. And that's, again, in one of your drip coffee makers. Have a good one.